we had? Okay, we have unit 9D, if you remember mo yan. Unit 9D. So, let us finish that one because we are not yet done. Okay, I will share to you the screen for unit 9D. Teacher, today I don't have mouse, so, uh, so I'm very hard to use the, the mouse. Very hard to use the mouse? Okay, is that your dad? Mm, yeah, my dad. Okay. Okay, so we are done with this, right? Okay. Already, already. Done. Finished, right? We are finished it yesterday. And this one also, you remember? Yeah. Oh, this one, wait. Are we done with this listening? Not yet. This one is finished, right? Yeah. And the listening is not yet. Are we? Did we listen this? Did we listen, Nguyen? No, I, we don't, we not uh, listening this before. Okay, so let us listen this, okay? Okay, yeah. listen to the whole text and check your answer to task four. Okay. These are your answers in the task four. Let us check if it really fit in. Lesson 9F Island Home It is one of the hardest places in the world to visit. First, you have to fly to Tahiti, an island in the South Pacific Ocean. Then, you have to travel by boat for nine days. During that time, you hardly ever see another boat or plane. And the final part of the journey is the most dangerous because of the rocks. Over the years, they have caused hundreds of boats to sink. You can still see some of the wrecks on the beaches. But finally, you arrive at the tiny tropical island of Palmerston, part of the Cook Islands. When you get there, you will get a very warm welcome. The islanders love visitors and look after them well. The island is very beautiful, with white sandy beaches and clear blue water. There are no cars. The main road in Palmerston is only about a hundred meters long and is made of sand with only about six buildings. There is a small school, but there are no shops. The families on Palmerston don't use money in their daily lives. They work together, look after each other, and share. When you run out of rice, you ask your next-door neighbour. They only use money to buy things from other countries. A ship visits the island twice a year and brings basic supplies like rice and fuel. The islanders need money to pay for this, so they catch and freeze fish. They then sell them to the ship and buy the things they need. But sometimes the ship doesn't come. Recently, 18 months passed without a visit from the ship. But that wasn't a problem. They could eat coconuts and fish. These days, the islanders access the internet for one or two hours a day, and they can even get a mobile phone signal, sometimes. But everyday experiences, like a visit to the dentist, can be a problem because the island is so remote. The nearest dentist is on Rarotonga, the capital of the Cook Islands. 
It takes four days to reach it by boat. And when the dentist has finished, you sometimes have to wait six months for a boat home. Some of the islanders love the remoteness and think their home is paradise. But others have decided to leave. In the past 50 years, the population of Palmerston has dropped from 300 to just 62. About 20 of these are children. Their life is very happy and relaxed. But as they get older, some of them want a university education. This means going abroad to study. They often plan to come home again after their studies, but in reality, they rarely return. But for the people who stay on the island, daily life is easy. Nobody works very hard, and there is a lot of free time. In the evenings, children swim in the beautiful blue ocean, or play volleyball on the beach. The adults watch TV. There is one TV on the island. Or chat. There is a policeman on Palmerston, but there isn't any crime. So he makes musical instruments instead. Okay. Okay. So do you think then they sell them to the ship and buy the things they need? Okay. It's letter D. Okay. Letter A. Where's letter A? So hear them. Okay. So visitors usually hear. Here is a place when they are spending time of the island. Okay. This is about, okay, Hermiston. Okay. So next one here. Okay, so this one. This is quite good, Nguyen. So this is about Farmiston Island. Okay. In here, you can answer in the chat box, Nguyen, for you this year. Okay. So please try to answer one to five. Answer the questions. There are five questions, and you can find the answer in the story about Palmerston Island. Okay. First, why is part of the journey to Palmerston is very dangerous? Okay. Please write your answer in the chat box about this activity and the questions to be answered. Okay. I know it's very easy. Everything is here. Okay. I will okay. give you like five minutes to answer.
Okay, Nguyen, please wait, teacher Ann. I will just go to the bathroom. I need to poop, okay? Please, sorry, Nguyen. Okay, Nguyen, can you hear me? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, I will just yeah. go to the bathroom, okay? Okay. Yeah, wait, teacher. Yeah, I will do
Teacher, I don't know. Uh, number five. Okay, Nguyen. Oh, do you have the answer now? How about the last know. one? I don't know. Number five. Okay, how about number one? Why is part of the journey to Palmerston is very dangerous? Oh, wait, wait, wait. What wait, do you think? Yeah. Why me? Yeah, okay. 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 Answer the question. Why is part of the journey to Palmerstone is very dangerous? Okay. You didn't have answer this. The answer is it's dangerous, Nguyen, because of the rocks. These have caused hundreds of boats to sink. Okay. That is the reason big yeah very good your answer is correct how many buildings are on the main road in palmerston how many buildings there are six uh, six buildings. buildings okay okay actually palmerston is just a very small island okay when you go there it is so small okay so actually it's so it's so entertaining to go there because the water is so clear it is clean but of course it is remote area so when we go there of course we can yeah. expect that we cannot find shops there are no shops in palmerstone okay how often do the islanders usually receive supplies correct it's only twice a year what problems do the islanders experience with internet and mobile phone signals? The only have access to the internet for one or two hours a day and they can always get a more phone signal. Okay, so actually they cannot access internet. Okay, they only have access to the internet for one or two two hours a day and they can always get a mobile phone signal. So the mobile phone signal is unstable. So they cannot contact you at any time, like only two hours for the internet. Okay, so it's so hard. Okay, how yeah. has the number of people living in the island? The population has dropped from 300 to 62 people only living there. So imagine there are only 62 people living in that area in Palmerstone. Okay, everything is so pure. Everything is just small. Okay. It is one of the hardest places in the world to visit. First, you have to fly to Tahiti and Island in the South Pacific Ocean. Then you have to travel by boat. For nine days. Okay, imagine nine. I don't know nowadays if there will be plane going there. During that time, yeah. you hardly ever see another boat or plane. And the final part of the journey is the most dangerous because of the rocks. Over the years, they have caused hundreds of boats to sink. You can still see some of the wrecks on the beaches. But finally, you arrive at the tiny tropical island of Palmerstone, part of the Cook Island. The islanders love visitors and look after them well. The island is very beautiful with white sandy beaches and clear blue water. There are no cars, 
the main road in Palmerston is only about 100 meters long. And it's made of sand with only about six buildings. There are small school, but there are no shops. The family of Palmerston don't use money in their daily lives, so they don't know money. When you run out of rice, you just ask to the next neighbor. They only use money to buy things from other countries. Okay, a shop visit the island twice a year, a ship. Okay, buy things from other countries. Okay, like basic supplies like rice and fuel. The islanders need money to pay for this. So they catch the fridge, uh, uh, they catch and freeze fresh. But sometimes the ship doesn't come. Recently, 18 months passed without a visit from the ship. But that wasn't a problem. We could eat coconuts and fish. Oh my God. Okay. These days, the islanders access the internet for one to two hours a day. And they can even get a problem because the island is so remote. The nearest dentist is in Rat Rarutonga, the capital of the Cook Island. And when the dentist has finished, sometimes had to wait six months for a boat home. Some of the islanders love the remoteness and think their home is paradise. But others have decided to leave. In the past few years, the population of Palmerston has dropped from 300 people to 62. Okay, 62 left. About 20 of these are children. Their life is very happy and relaxed. But at the get older, some of them want university education. They often plan to come home again after study, but in reality, they rarely return. But for the people who stay on the island, daily life is easy. Nobody works very hard, and there is a lot of free time. In the evening, children swim in the beautiful blue ocean or play volleyball on the beach. I go to watch TV. There is only one TV on the island. There is a policeman on Palmer Stone, but there isn't any crime, so he makes musical instruments instead. So everything in Palmer Stone is a quiet place. Okay, imagine that one if you leave now. Here, Muyan, please try to match the two halves of the collocations below. They are all in the text. Okay? Okay. Go, Nguyen. Đóng cửa lại em hai okay.
natin, Uyan, three minutes more. Okay. Okay, let us have this. Okay, let us check. Okay, tropical island. Sandy beaches. Okay, basic supplies. Next door. Neighbor, very good. Daily life. Free time. Okay, so these are the different activity. Okay, so... Uh, Imagine your life in Palmerston. So as what teacher Anne told you, life in Palmerston is very simple. Okay. For a people who wants a busy life, of course, they don't like to live there. It's because in Palmerston, everything is so simple. Okay. Like just pure, simple. As in you will not think a lot of, a lot of, a lot of it. Okay, in the morning, I get up at 9 o'clock and walk along the beach to school. Okay, so that is, okay. So here, daily routine, food and drink, entertainment that you have to do, like volleyball, watch TV only. And it is said that if you watch TV in Palmerston, there is only one TV. Okay, and the, and the, and the kids or the children will just swim in the beach. Of course, they really know how to swim well because they live in the island. Okay, so that's part of Palmerston. Very simple. Okay, so here uh, we have this one. We don't have enough time for yet. So teacher Anne will say goodbye and I will see you on. Goodbye. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, I will see you on. Uh, we, have we have a mega class. Yeah, we'll have a makeup class. When do you want? Mm, Saturday, are you free? Yeah, what time on Saturday, Nguyen? Mm, 9. 9 a.m.? 9 a.m. Uh, I will check Saturday. Oh, Saturday, I have class at 9 a.m. How about um, 8 a.m. Saturday? Are you okay? Uh, I'm okay. 8. 8. Yeah. Okay. Eight. I will see you 8 p.m. Saturday. Oh, please tell your mom, okay? Yeah. Okay. Bye, Huyen. See you on Saturday. Bye, see you too. Saturday. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Bye-bye.